Well, welcome back, guys, to Loki and Gaming. Um, this is supposed to be a comedy game. If that really offends you, jump out now. Okay, this is called Walking Simulator. And I'm sure that was perfectly inspirational. So one small step for man. This is literally just a walking simulator. We're going to be walking from point A to point B. Or in my case, we're going to be running. Because we're going to this fancy. Look, he's like, yay! Um, this game is like stupidly ex uh, addictive. It's free. And it's so riddled with wrong things in it. Yes, I, I see. Okay, there's a jetpack. There's some other... Okay. I wanted to check that out. There's a snack machine. Okay, um, everything in the future can be bought for likes. Actually, it's not the future, it's 2020. And in this reality... Um, let's just say we don't have to worry about there being any humans anymore. Because a certain virus has wiped everybody off the planet, except for a few stragglers. And we are the delivery service, so we're the mailman. That's what we are. Or UPS or something. But do you see the epic beauty of this game? I mean, it's just, it's, it's lovely. <laughs> There were a few people that wrote bad reviews because they didn't think it was in good taste, but I thought, you know, it's actually pretty damn pr uh, pretty, and it's funny in its own really dark survivalist way. Um, what can I say? So, you see, it's like totally a walking sim because it's showing us where to go with that uh, sort of teardrop arrow in front of us. And we currently only have one, like, we don't do too much of this, but I just wanted to give you guys a taste, because I thought this was actually pretty funny. I've actually been self-quarantining, not because of any kind of fears, but because you guys know I have raging allergies right now, and I've been coughing and hacking and wheezing. And I can see me already in a tent being tested and screeching that I don't have anything, it's just my allergies. So I've actually been self-quarantining. Um, until allergy season settles down, I'm gonna sound like I'm in the last stages of something or other. So how are you guys doing? You staying calm? You avoiding the corona beer? Yeah, um, America being the super intelligent country we are. Um, Americans at least, I think it's like 35% won't drink corona beer. <laughs> because that's where the virus comes from. <laughs> Yeah, we try. Um, we have to avoid those hostiles. So we'll try to steal our stuffs. And we don't want to go into landslides, obviously. Or avalanches. Avalanches, not landslides. I actually think it's good to laugh at stuff. I mean, is it serious? Yeah. Is it sad that people have died? Yes. But you know what? Humor helps people keep stuff in perspective. No, we can pick up more stuff if we want to. But I did a clean run. Well, not the entire game, but I did a clean run the first time I was playing this, so... And as you see, it's totally a walking simulator. I just, I think it's funny in a kind of absurdist kind of way. And there is a lot of walking in this simulator. I can't remember where this first station is. But it's kind of like a walking sim, the hiking simulator. Remember I showed you both of those around um, Christmas or Yule? Yeah, it's like the same deal, only this run is free. And this one, depending on the number of likes you get, you can buy stuff like chip packs and snowmobiles. Yeah. 
and apparently it's kind of like a game that will be coming out. It's kind of weird. I think those dudes just kind of knock you, knock your stuff off of you because I ran smack into one, and all I did was I lost some of my um, cargo. But this is actually kind of nice. Just keep running. The only thing to make this perfect is you'd have to figure out a way to weigh your um, W and your shift key down. And then you could just, you know, just sit here and kind of move your mouse occasionally. Tap E every so often. Look, he's like, God, you're lazy. I love you. I'm so proud. Oh my god, but this is so much fun. Stupid and absurdist. And it's making light of a scary situation, so we'll have done that. Yeah, I, I told Lucky at least I can't afford to go anywhere. <laughs> It's stupidly fun. Thank you. So we can tank it. There we go. The cup of tea. Oh no, what did we do? Did we buy stuffies? Okay, I guess we bought stuff. Okay. I don't know what we just did. Okay, so... Go to Central Command Center. I think. There we go. There we go, we're back on track. I don't know what happened. I thought I had more packs. I don't know. But also, you can jump. Because you were epic. That's why. If you learn to switch hands while you're running, you can drink your coffee. Give your hand a break. Close that dude. Actually, for what it is, it's not bad. It's there. There's something stupidly pretty about it. Reminds me of those actual games. I mean, those really hard intellectual games that are not this game. There you go. Loki's back. Are you just like it because it looks like the Halo suit? True. How did we get more likes in the first run? Oh my god. Somebody out there is being generous. Um, it's a game. I don't know, man. It's just, it's really relaxing. And I never thought I'd say that about a game. And honestly, if you didn't know what the supposed story of the game is, and I know it and I think it's funny, I don't I don't think anybody would have thought anything of it. But it's called Walking Simulator. They could have called it Delivery Guy or something and just not put a story on it.
But as many of the um, reviews say, I'm saving you guys 60 bucks right here. I mean, there's another game that may be coming to PC pretty soon. This is, you can see how superior this is, right? You can see this is just awesome-tastic. Yeah, telling yourself that. It's just weirdly soothing. I tried the controls, I tried the, um, Control pad, I couldn't get it to work. This would be better if you could get the uh, control pad um, control pad to work. At least I couldn't. Um, only because if you're over 40, your damn hand starts cramping up after a while. <laughs> We've already played this for a while. We're playing it for you guys, so yeah. You older people out there, be careful. Don't get a hand cramp. So old, delicate. Yeah, I, I woke up today and, and my allergies were bothering me and I was like, Dick. So I'm self-quarantining, not from any kind of fear or anything, but I know people will scatter like the wind the first time I cough or sneeze. So I'm like, yeah, I'll just self-quarantine for a while. And I have some of those uh, masks that people are wearing and that they're telling people not to buy because they actually don't do anything and doctors and nurses need them. So, I, I actually have some of those. We got those dust masks. And I have my, if you guys remember, my, my pink one. My lovely pink one. And we ran out of music. There we go. There's just something stupidly pretty about this. Now around here somewhere is where I ran face first into a guy who just popped out of nowhere. <laughs> I just didn't see him, I ran right into him. Honestly, I picked up the extra stuff so that if I smack into him again, he doesn't take the actual cargo I need. He's around here somewhere. I ran face first into him. So we're actually not too far from our next destination, if I remember. going up this way actually might save ourselves a few steps. There's just something dumb and fun about these kind of games. The only thing, the only caveat I have with this one is there's no, um, there's no save function. So you can't start a mission and then like save and then start it again. Hanging in? I mean, clearly, this is a groundbreaking game. It's like hiking sim, only there's actual stuff to do. And there are no wolves and bears. But I've seen yet. I've seen yet.
It's, it's actually weirdly kind of fun. It's kind of relaxing. And at least this one has a um, directional thing so you know where the hell you're going. So you're not wandering around the map forever looking for your next objective. There we go. So it's kind of fun. Okay, I forget which door it is. Oh my god! My my cargo disappeared! When the hell did that happen? Oh damn it, I can't complete the objective. My cargo's gone. When the hell did that happen? God damn it. This game. Where the hell did my cargo go to? Because he didn't take it. Oh, god damn it. Oh, shit. Did that drop off and I didn't notice it? Oh. Okay. Get a jetpack and reach a mountaintop. Okay. Alright, so let's hit E. Alright, so that was just... I was freaking out because that's a hell of a long run to run the whole way back and look for it. Okay. Of course that's how it works. Why wouldn't it? So beautiful. Press X to stand up. <laughs> stand up, idiot. Come on, come on. You can do it, baby. That's it. Come on. You got it. Come on! Oh, come on! <laughs> okay.
Okay, let's see how the approach is. Gotta be almost there. Yeah, there it is. Okay, I'm going to stop it there, but you get your idea. Um, this poor dude cannot get up there. Um, but if you guys like what you see, like, comment, and subscribe. I figured I'd play something stupidly absurdist for you. And I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.